Good morning, people of the internet. Gabriel here. I'm gonna talk about CC type library. So, you're wondering now, what the fuck is CC type or C type dot h? Overview. These functions take the integer equivalent of one character as parameter and return an integer that can either be another character or a value representing a boolean value. An integer value of zero means false and an integer value different from zero represents true. Basically, CC type or C type.h for C programming language is a library. There are two sets of functions, character classification and character conversion. Classification check whether the character pass as parameter belongs to a certain category, while conversion checks and converts the letters cases. Basically, this is the functions of the CC type library. Is al num, is alpha, is blank, is control, is digit, is graph, is lower, is print, is func, is space, is x digit, is upper, to lower, and to upper. And the definition can be seen on the screen. The syntax is the function followed by the parentheses. Inside the parentheses, is the value that that will be checked by the program. The character conversion functions are to lower. They convert uppercase letter to lowercase, while to upper converts lowercase to uppercase. Their function, their syntax is the same. Now let us try to code the program. We include the library. CC type for C++ programming language and for C programming language they should include C type dot H. Let's declare a string value named as X. And we're going to use is alnum or is alphanumeric to check the input. Let's put an if condition here. Is al num means alphanumeric, then parentheses, then the input declaration. Then for the corresponding statement, The input is not alphanumeric, else it will output I'm sorry here, this should be string, it should be character. If you want to use string, you will add a condition between the declared input and type in there false. Since so we're going to use characters, we don't need that. Now let us try the program. Alphanumeric characters are located in your keyboard in the alphanumeric place. For example, we input the letter A. This alpha defines it as an alpha an alphanumeric character and out, output it as an alphanumeric character. For example, let's try to input the plus symbol. Since it's not an alphanumeric character, the program out, output it as a wrong. In this program type that I created, you can see the other function is alpha, digit, graph, lower, print, punctuation, upper, x digit, and their corresponding output. Let us try the program. For example, let's input the letter A, the big letter A. The 
program defines it as an alphanumeric, alphabetic, graphical, printable, and an uppercase and an hexadecimal character. For example, let's input the slash. The program identifies it as a graphical, printable, and punctuation character. For the is space function, we declare the input as backslash n. For is blank, we did not declare anything. We de just declared a blank space. For is control, we declared the control character backslash n. Let's try the program. The input declared is backslash n. Since backslash n produces a space, therefore it is a space. Since the input declared is a space, since a space is considered as a blank, then it output as a blank. Lastly, the control character declared is backslash n. The control characters, some of its examples are backslash n, backslash c, and backslash r. And the program output is a control character. The function to upper we will ask the user to input a character, then the program will convert it to lowercase to uppercase and vice versa for to lower. Let's try the program. For example, we like to input the lowercase a. The to upper function converts the lowercase a to uppercase. For example, let's try to input the big letter C. The to lower function converts the inputted inputted character to a lower case. Basically, that is CC type. CC type is very useful in case sensitive inputs such as passwords. And thank you for all listening and have a good day.